Yeah, all right, welcome back everybody, man. Um, today's video we're gonna be showcasing a little bit of DBZ love. Um, you know, I really grew up and I love Dragon Ball Z, so uh, I want to show you guys my top favorite attacks um, in Dragon Ball Z. So yeah, well, without further ado, let's get into it, man. And here is Special Beam Cannon is special. Okay, it really is. It was one of those first attacks you've seen that actually had a, another name to it. Like you know what I mean? Like we know the Kamehameha, we knew Double Sunday. You know what I mean? But this thing, this thing, he held this move out just so he could kill his op. All right, Piccolo held this move out just to kill Goku. Just to, this was mo this move was designed to kill Goku. This uh, in on any game you cannot block this move. Especially in Xenoverse, it's unblockable, and it should be. This move, you concentrate your fingers, you know, to your head, and you just concentrate. Your veins are pulsating, you, you know, your body's just fluctuating with immense power, and it's concentrating into your two fingers, and you just blast them things into a spiral-type death beam. It is amazing. It will pierce you. It, it, it destroyed Raditz. It killed two Saiyans in one. This move is legendary, okay? Absolutely legendary, right? One of my favorite moves. And Piccolo is my favorite character, so it, it's only fitting. Special Beam Cannon is very special. I really love this move. I like that they keep bringing it back. In every every form of Dragon Ball, whether it be Kai, whether it be GT, whether it be um, you know Super Heroes, any of that, they're always bringing um, Special Beam Cannon, and I love it. Special Beam Cannon is amazing, guys. This is a go-to. All right. Check this out, especially if you can it, man. Ah, oh, man, I love it. All right, um, for this one, we have Body Change. Now, Body Change is used by Captain Ginyu. Uh, this is legendary in its own right. Uh, first time I seen it, again, just marveled at it. Like, wow, did he really just switch bodies? And, you know, it's so crazy because this might not, not even be Ginyu's original body. He's probably done this so many times, we don't even know what he looks like. But... Um, he did spam it so much that he, yeah, he got turned into a frog, right? <laughs> like, not a regular frog, it was like a Namekian frog. So, um, that sucks. Otherwise, the drawbacks to this thing, I, I haven't really seen anything negative other than Goku really being smart and throwing the frog. But, I mean, if you can intercept it, then, you know, the body change can be kind of gross. But other than that, this thing is pretty flawless. You get to, you know, switch bodies with people, you know, and get their powers and, and all their... All the stuff, like it's pretty cool. Like I like body chains. It was very, very. It was utilized pretty cool by uh, Ginyu. Like very sneaky. It's a very sneaky move, man. But uh, I feel like this was this is, move really needs to be highlighted. I really like this move. It's one of my favorites in the show. So yeah, check this out, man. Body chains. Which more people would do it? Honestly, which more people would do it? All right. Now, one of my favorite attacks is I beams. Um, I beams is throughout the whole show. Everyone use I beams. Right, it is. It's a move that is super sneaky. Right, um, it's you know Superman really coined this. I mean, let's be real. <laughs> Superman and Cyclops from X Men, they really coined this thing. But I beams and Dragon Ball Z have to be my favorite moves. Okay, Piccolo, Kami, uh, Majin Buu used it. Um, Cooler, uh, Android 19. Oh, I, there's countless people who've used I beams in this show they're amazing they're, they're sneaky Nappa used them I just love the eye beam the eye beam is crazy you just getting popped but your eyes and boom just some of the best best attacks in all of Dragon Ball okay now you guys not yet think so but I do it's a very sneaky move it's a very cool move man who just wouldn't want to shoot freaking laser beams out their eyes I would all right so that that's it right there that's it for me like <laughs> that's my pitch that's my favorite moves man right there i beams is one of my favorites man all right um we got death beam death beam you know death beam um very 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 legendary i remember the first time i seen this and he just popped dende with it killed him i feel like this show is amazing right um i mean we all feel some sort of way when dende died but yeah, Death Beam, essentially it's a one-shot laser, straight. It's, 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 it's in the name itself, Death Beam. You will die. Um, there have been many examples of the show of people using Death Beam. Um, as you're seeing right here, you know, all that good stuff. But Death Beam with Frieza is just legendary. All right, It fits him so good. 
death beam just saying it ah man it's one of my favorite moves in the show's entirety okay give it up for death beam all right we need more death beam finger blasts are fun they're funny <laughs> you know what i mean and they kill all right so yeah th th this is my death beam all right i, I absolutely death beam now we have kienzan right like, we have destructo disc right one of my favorite techniques Ever. One of my favorite attacks, man. Krillin is my favorite Earthling, right? Krillin is my favorite. And when he popped this thing off, whoo, against Nappa, I was like, whoa, <laughs> whoa. Even Vegeta knew he had to duck. This thing is incredible. This is Krillin's go to thing is Destructive Disc. Hell, he even taught it to his wife. Okay, she even busts out the Destructo Disc. Um, I, I, even Frieza busts out the Destructo Disc. Everybody's using Destructo Disc. It is amazing. He can do a gigantic one. He can do. He can break them down into smaller ones. This thing touches you. You're dead. It, it instant cut. Instant cut. It is Krillin's best move. It's a move he should be spamming forever. It's one of those moves where it's like, why doesn't anybody else use this? Like we should be using this every single time we fight. I would. I'd be busting this thing out every time I fight killing everyone but destructo disc is my favorite you just spin it like a top oh man and it, it, it it'll cut you it'll cut you deep but yeah this, this is this is one of my favorite attacks ever in all of dragon ball lore all right destructo disc well that's it for me for this video man make sure y'all hit that like button i really appreciate it again man i'll see y'all in the comment section man let me know what's your favorite attacks let me know what your i would like guys come on let me know what your favorite attacks are in dragon ball all right, I know I missed some. I'm going to keep cranking these out, guys. We're only going to get into more moves, but I'll see you on the next episode. Thank you all for rocking with me. I really appreciate it. Thank you all for hitting that like button. And, yeah, see ya.